I'm Jack Waller. I'm representing James L. Waller. We called him Butchie. Uh, my Uncle Butch was a, a young man when he went to service, 17 years old. 1966, he came home from his first leave from Vietnam, and he uh, we had a Fourth of July party, and he went to light some fireworks and set himself on fire. So it was it was kind of funny. Uh, a year later, he came home from Vietnam on his second tour, and uh, he brought home an AK-47. That was a war trophy that the government had let him bring home. Uh, his th third tour home, he, my grandma was real sick, his mom, and he came home and had to leave back. On his fourth tour back, he, um, he was killed on the same day that he got back in Vietnam. <laughs> and that's, um, we all miss him and we all love him. <laughs> I'm Betty Buck and I'm from Pueblo and uh, Carl, we were born in Arkansas and Carl grew up in Pueblo and he was in, uh, he graduated from Central High School and he had fiery red hair and talked to everyone. Everyone loved him and we've been fortunate enough to see the wall in Washington DC and it's a very emotional time even after all these years. But um, United States he was killed in Vietnam in 1969. So, just. Janet Lavu Swearingen. Um, I'm here to honor my brother, John Allen Lavu. Uh, he was a ma Marine pilot, um, shot down in 1968. Um, he. Um, I don't know what to say. He was, um, he was real proud to serve in Vietnam. Um, it was his second tour over. Um, um, and um, he's been missed. <laughs> United States Navy. Thank you. 